What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the Chance Bishop Show for episode 39 of our MLB The Show 23, Road to the Show, featuring none other than Chance Bishop and the Philadelphia Phillies. Uh, so Chance and the Phillies, they have a lot going on right now. They're in the NLCS. Now we're taking on an opponent here. It was either the Dodgers or the Reds based off of last episode. So we'll be finding out shortly which opponent we are actually taking on right now. And it is going to be... That's a very dramatic intro. A very dramatic intro right here. It's going to be Philadelphia taking on the Cincinnati Reds. This is a 2010 postseason rematch. So of course, Phillies and Reds didn't match up here in the NLCS in 2010. Phillies matched up with the Giants. But it was going to be the Phillies and Reds in the 2010 NLDS. But still a 2010 postseason rematch between uh, the two clubs. So, is that David Bell? Is David Bell still the manager somehow of this team? I don't know what David Bell's character model is, honestly, in MLB 23. So, maybe that was him. Probably not, honestly. But who knows? So on the, I guess, getting ready right there on the mound, Shane McClellahan for Philadelphia. He's 1-0 in the postseason, 7 2 thirds innings pitch. No earned runs allowed. Four hits, 117 whip. Five, wa ugh, five walks, 12 punch outs from McClellahan. So Philadelphia coming off of a 23 to nothing offensive outputting in their last series. Yeah, they outscored the last opponent 23 nothing. Philly's up 1 nothing so far with, an out, with two outs in the inning against Lodolo. That's going to be a fly out and foul grounds played by the first baseman right there. So that's going to be the final out of the inning. All right, so the Phillies have already given up more runs in this one game uh, than they did all previous series. As Chance gets a base knock there. It just kind of plopped in there, stayed fair somehow. But there you go, Chance Bishop. Now 5-4 lead right now, and Chance chases the high cheddar very too much high. That's a big punch. That's going to end the inning. Now, bottom 8, 0-2 count. Chance swings the slider down low. Put a Nick Castellanos on that one. Just chase low against Noah Syndergaard, former Philly legend. But 6-4 victory. McClellahan gets his second win. Lodolo the loss. And Hader picks up the save. So, big save for the Hader aid right there. And then we're going to move on to game number 2. Up one nothing in the series. So that's all that's going to matter, honestly, in this series. Staying ahead and just keeping things moving. Andrew Painter, one start, one win, eight innings, four hits, three walks, seven punch-ups, and a .88 whip. So hopefully Painter, dominant as he was in his first outing of the postseason. So let's hopefully keep the train rolling. We have four straight victories here in the postseason as Chance grounds down to the third base. And who keeps it in front of him? And that's going to be a ground out to end the first inning. And, you know, Ellie De La Cruz is doing his thing. one nothing Phillies lead. Ground ball up the middle. Base hit with two outs in the inning. A runner from first. Going to stay at second there. So we're just going to make Hunter Green throw some extra pitches, honestly. Which, honestly, that can, that can add up after a while. You throw enough extra pitches... It kind of sucks. Bottom six, Hunter Green still out there. Chance Bishop. Uh, he flies that one out to the left fielder right there. So a no contest at that bat. 5-3 lead down the seventh chance. Liner left field. That's a base knock past the shortstop. And there you go. Chance Bishop with two outs in the inning. Uh, gets himself a single. So keep it being alive against Jordan Montgomery. And we're going to move on to a victory. That is going to be five straight victories here for Philadelphia. Dylan Daw with the win. Williamson with the loss. And Josh Hader back-to-back -back games with the save. And the Phillies have win, won five consecutive games here in this postseason run. Looking to win the sixth consecutive postseason game. As we're going to move on to game number three. Out here at Great American Ballpark. You know, Great American Ballpark, home of the Reds and the cheapest owners in all of baseball, probably. But Eric Lauer... Uh, one start, one loss, a 360 year in five innings pitch, three hits, a 140 whip, four walks, three punch outs. Ugh, not a great stat line there for Lauer, as Eric is uh, the lefty. Just did not have his stuff last out. Two outs, runner on first. That one's down the right field line. That one's going to roll all the way in the corner. Kicks off the wall. Unfortunately, the runner in front of us only has 47 speed, but he's going to truck around third. 
slide into home, and he's gunned down. All right, nothing, nothing game here. Bottom first chance feels that one. Zach Gallon gets Novelli Marte to ground out for the first out here of the game. So big put out there for Chance Bishop, as he's showing you that hey, he is not just an offensive weapon. It's a two nothing game now. Novelli Marte's up again. Chance Bishop backhands it. He's gonna take it to first himself for the second out here in the inning, as the runner goes from second to third on the play. So there you go, one out now in the inning. And Chance Bishop uh, looking to hold on to something. Top of the fourth year, Chance drives that one deep to left field. That one's back. Back at the wall and gone off that high porch in left field. Sixth home run of the postseason for Chance, cutting the lead in half here. So honestly, that might be the break Philadelphia needs coming into this inning. You know, down by two runs, Chance makes it a one-run game here. As Lauer struggled in his first outing. Now he's going to play face some adversity right now. He'll have to rebound after giving up the leadoff home run. 3-2 game now in the sixth, and Chance Bishop pops this one up. High fastball, a little late on it. And that's a fly out to right field, and that's not going to be the at-bat you wanted. That's a big out number one here in the sixth. Come on, Philadelphia, you can rally here. Tie game in the eighth. Chance Bishop, Williamson, ground ball that... Second baseman, that's definitely not Jonathan India at this point of their careers, right? 2028, that is actually still Jonathan India. Wow, I am surprised by that, that they kept on to him so long. Top of the 10th, two outs, Chance Bishop hanging pitch, drives to right field, and he got all of it. Absolutely unloaded on the Montgomery curveball. Seventh home run of the postseason, second home run of the game for Chance Bishop. As he is putting the team on his back in this one. You know, one big swing in the bat there. And Josh Hader, oh, you know he's coming out for the save. He's got to come out for this save, right? Josh Hader with a one-run lead. He's got it. Dominant lefty, hard throwing up and in kind of guy. Come on, Chance. Secure the victory here against the Reds. Make it a 3 nothing game. That's what we need, honestly. Make it a 3 0 series. And there you go. Hader comes out for the save. Phillies take a 3 0 lead. Hader's pitched three days in a row. And Dodd gets back to back wins. Montgomery out of the bullpen gets the loss as he just hung that curveball right there. You know, Chance Bishop, when he gets a hanging off speed pitch, he, he very rarely misses it. And when he gets them, he gets them. He gets them real big. All right, so here we go. Philadelphia has a commanding three games to none lead over the Reds. Now Chase Petty, one start, a 7.20 ERA in five innings. Five hits, a 180 whip, four walks, five punch outs. Probably not the player you want to be sending them out in this situation. Philadelphia with a one nothing lead with two outs. Chance with two balls in the count. Flies to left field, that's going to end the inning. So no damage done by Chance there as Petty limits the damage. Now it's 2-0, two, 2-on, two, 2 out here. Full count, dead center field. And that's a fly out. All right, Petty again limiting damage so far. Only 2-0 here in this one. 3-0, base is yoked. And a liner to the third baseman turns the double play to India. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. What happened there? Eight nothing. All right, that's that. That sound about right. Bishop right center field. That one's gonna get over the wall in right field. That's the third home run of this series. Eighth home run of the postseason for Chance Bishop. And there you go. That's gonna be off the reliever. That's not what he wanted to do. This game was already a blowout enough as it was. But now you're gonna have Chance just teeing off on y'all, embarrassing you, hitting some home runs. Like, come on. Like, you, you can't make them feel that bad for you, right? Like, you gotta do something here. 11 nothing, two on, no one out here in the bottom of the sixth inning. Jazz Chisholm Jr. up, ground ball to the second baseman, who goes to the short, who goes back to chance in time. That's a double play right there, runner on third base now. So, 4-6-3. Now, top of the eighth, chance Bishop, right field, that one's gonna get down. That's going to be a one-out single here in the eighth inning. That's probably going to be Chance's last at bat, and it is, as the Philadelphia Phillies are victorious here in the NLCS 
They're going to be heading back to the World Series. So they went to the World Series two seasons ago. They're going back to the World Series this year. They're looking for their fourth, fourth World Series title in franchise history as they're the 2028 National League champions. So Philadelphia looking to hopefully, and I do mean looking to hopefully, get get things under wraps here. So hopefully Philadelphia can get their minds right, get ready. They swept the last two rounds. You know, they haven't lost yet in the playoffs. And it is just going to be whoever we match up in the World Series, it's going to be a tough opponent. It's going to be a very tough opponent right now. But right now, Philadelphia's not thinking about that. Until they have to find out that's either going to be a 2022 or a 2009 rematch in the World Series between either the Yankees or the Astros. Paul Taxi Minchie, though. Peace out. Rock on. I'll catch you.